This training will address the hydrant recorder program from the Aurora Water Department. The Water Department uses hydrant recorders during summer months to evaluate water main pressure. During this time, there can be over 20 of the recording devices dispersed throughout the city. These hydrants are in service, however. They are charged and need to be shut down prior to opening caps for water supply. Okay, my name is Gary Martinez. Uh, I've been with the Water Department for six years in hydrants. Um, I'll be explaining the hydrant recorders a little bit, what they are, what they do, and how we put them on. Um, so basically what this does is there's a little computer in there that records the hydrant pressures, uh, constantly records. These are wireless, so they record constantly. It gets constantly sent back to us if we need to pull up a pressure in case there's a water break or something, it will, find, it will see the pressure drop in here. Um, it comes with a lock, so no one can mess with it. Uh, so that's basically all it is, it's just a gasket, it threads on. Uh, these are used to tighten it onto the hydrant, these little notches here. Okay, so one of the biggest things to remember if you pull up this fire hydrant, you need to use it. It is in service and you can use it. You just have to remember that when this is on there, it's pressurized. So you want to come, the first thing you want to do is you want to turn the hydrant off before you do anything else with this hydrant, otherwise it will shoot. This thing will shoot 50 yards down the way. rather than this cap since they're, this will hinder you a little bit. So these caps can be used. Uh, there is leftover pressure in the hydrant after you turn it off, so you want to bleed it out. It's usually easier through the two and a half inch nozzle. So just go real slow, you'll hear the air start to release. It's easy to use your hand and just wiggle out the pressure. Both caps. 